Howdy ho neighbors, Rado Goji here, and welcome back to Squeeze the World Gaming Lego Marvel Avengers. Just hold triangle, even though nowhere else in the game tells you to do that to proceed. Seriously, fuck that. When we last left off, Ultron became self-aware and is trying to take us out, and now we've got a whole bunch more obvious puzzles that we can actually do. I didn't want to do that. I actually wanted to switch back to Iron Man. Is it? Can... Actually, the, the I, I left off with the uh, can. Can we take the suit back off by holding triangle? Please back away. It doesn't look like it. Just basically takes us into a cutscene. Looks like. So I guess all that stuff that I saw back there with the fix it area. That's probably not going to be until we come back and free play. How is humanity saved if it's not allowed to? Evolve. Look at these. These puppets. There's only one path to peace. The Avengers extinction. Oh no. Are we gonna go back into another movie? Strings, but now I'm free. Uh see we can actually use We can actually use music from Pinocchio because Marvel's actually owned by Disney. Yay! Oh, he took over Stoker Mansion. And no sooner did we start the Let's Play video part, and we're done with the, um... Done with the level. I didn't see an achievement pop, though. What's up with that? Normally, an achievement pop once, once we, uh, or the trophy, rather. The trophy pops once I beat a level. Oh, maybe it'll pop later. Okay, so that's Captain America with no helmet. That's just... Okay, these are just outright being unlocked for us. Maria Hill. Iron Man Mark 16. Not sure which one that one is, but that's one of our... And Ultron Mark 1. Those are our uh, character tokens that we picked up. I'm personally looking forward to Silver Centurion because I got a minifigure of him for pre-ordering the game. And they were making a big deal out of it. And I know Silver Centurion's in the game, so... He looks cool. That's like Mark... Well, it's like Model 6 or something like that in the... It was called in the... In the comics, but, uh... Because they weren't called Mark anything in the comics. Nuclear codes. Nuclear codes. Cat videos. The world's a big place. It started making it smaller. Okay, so we're just going to keep going on with Age of Ultron and not go on with any of the other older movies? Because there were lots of movies that took place in between. I've come to save the world. Oh, by the way, um, I know it really doesn't matter, but I've... Uh, with my currently being done with LEGO Dimensions, I've currently expanded upon my... Um, I know that guy. My, my minifigure no, display at work. Black market arms. A lot of my Lego Dimension figures are at my, are at my job now, or my desk at work now, and also a bunch of other ones that I didn't have on there before. Like uh, Ultron is one of them. Like the uh, as far as like the the Hulkbuster set went, I only had like Iron Man and the Hulkbuster there, but I brought in Ultron and Scarlet Witch, and well, I actually did have Hulk there as well. I forgot to mention Hulk, um, but I brought in Ult Ult Ultron and Scarlet Witch because why not? Basically, brought in everything that wasn't tied down that I was interested in. So I have, like, all the Portal stuff and all the Doctor Who stuff there, and he's got sunglasses, and... This is just a free roam area. Ulysses Claw should be on a ship called the Churchill. Stay on the lookout. All right, fair enough. South Africa. Yep, this is a free roam area. Because I got a raider. Um... Are there ghost studs that are... I want to be Iron Man, because Iron Man... Let me be Iron Man. He's my favorite Marvel hero. Also like the X-Men, as I've said. Okay, there's ghost studs that'll tell me where to go. Um... So... I don't know... I mean, I, I know that you, like... For example, I'm just going to do this real quick. If you push the touchpad button, or I guess the select button on... You'll say go to space. You don't have to... I'm not going to go to space. I'm just going to go where the... Where the uh, the game leads me, but I'm guessing all of those other le levels I unlock, because no strings on me, is 
goes into the Age of Ultron, obviously, as we saw. And that's where the game automatically took us after we were done with the actual Avengers. Uh, first Avengers movie stuff. But I think all the other levels that were unlocked were for, like, Iron Man 3 and Winter Soldier and uh, Thor Dark World. Um... So I'm really not sure where this is leading us. It looks, it looks like it's leading us into more Age of Ultron. So I'm really not sure if it's just like the other story stuff is stuff we're going to be seeing later. Um, because, you know, as, as we've seen, it started us off in Age of Ultron, the beginning of Age of Ultron. Then it went into um, the first Avengers movie with uh, the first Captain America movie as a flashback in one level. And then um, the rest of the Avengers movie, the, the rest of the Avengers movie, the first Avengers movie, and then back in Age of Ultron again. So I don't know if this is going to lead us into Iron Man three, or Thor: Dark World, or Captain America: Winter Soldier, or more Age of Ultron. Um, like I said, this is blind. The only thing I've looked up so far is that um, Iron Man suit equip bullshit that the. <laughs> Again, the game didn't tell me about it. I'm still not I'm still not over that. That's There may have been a point somewhere that I might have overlooked. But it wasn't important that like there it wasn't required for me to do that up until that point. So I don't know. But this is silver, so I can destroy that. And that makes a... Ooh, push switch. Oh, okay. So that makes a fan. That's going to... Oh, I thought it was going to push us upward. Well, it's not. Okay. Well, there's this anchor-shaped thing here. Seriously, I don't see why I need anyone else. Just ult uh, Iron Man. Iron Man can win the whole game. He's, like, the most versatile person I have here. Oh, well, actually, now we need Thor. Okay. That's fine. Thor. I think Black Widow could do it, too, but... Thor. Um... I know it's not really all that topical anymore, but I know that, um... I, I, this is something that I did want to talk about. Um... You can probably... Speaking of Thor, you can probably... Now that I've mentioned Thor, you probably get where I'm going with this. Thor is a woman. Um... It didn't really make much sense to me at first until... Like I said, I've been, I've been binge-watching Atop the Fourth Wall, and I saw the origin story for Thor in the Marvel comics. And it does make a bit more sense to me now. Now, hear me out. It's not that I was against Thor being a woman at all. Like, or at least Thor's place being taken by a woman. It's just I didn't know how Thor originally was in Marvel Comics. I didn't know that at first he was a guy who turned into Thor. But, like, at the time, I was, you know... I had, all I knew about Thor was what I'd really seen in uh, seen in uh, what it was told what was told to me about the comics, what I'd seen in video games and the movies and such, where Thor is an alien from the planet Asgard, uh, and yeah, that's Thor. Like Asgard is like an al uh, like all the Norse gods are aliens, and it didn't make much sense for me for you know someone to just come around and get the hammer and then all of a sudden her name is Thor, and. You know, some of my friends are saying, oh, well, you know, it's, it's the title of Thor being passed to her, and I'm like, well, no, it's fucking not, because Thor is the guy's name. It's not a code name or a title that he has. That's that's his name. That's, like, Steve. Like, or, or Dave, or Bob. That's Thor is his name. Thor is an actual name for people. People are named that. It's like if a woman... Um, became the new Iron Man. And instead of being called Iron Man, she was called Tony. It, it's not the same damn thing. But then I recently saw the origin story for Marvel Thor, and I found out, oh, 
it kind of is at the same time. Like, I know that there, like, there's the alien Thor, but there's also the guy... Uh, I forget his name, but he found a staff that could turn into the hammer. I'm just kind of wandering around just so I can keep talking. Um, <laughs> there's the, the, turn to, the, the the hammer gave him Thor's powers and, and name, basically. And going with that, that makes more sense to, you know, if, if like, so if a, a lady got the, the hammer, like this, the doctor, Donald, whatever his name is, like that, this, that, that makes more sense to me. I, I, I if I hadn't have seen that, I, I probably would still be on. Why is she called Thor? Why can't she be called like Freya or something like that? Because, you know, Thor is this guy's actual name. It's not a title, but if they're going for more of, like, the original Thor, um, or the original, uh, the, like, the, like, the Silver Age Thor, um, kind of a way to give her the powers, that makes more sense. So I'm, I'm not really against, I mean, I was never against the, 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 the position of Thor being taken by a woman. I just didn't think it made much sense for her to be called Thor at first, but now I know, and knowing is half the battle. G.I. Joe, and all that stuff. What, are the bad guys now? Where are the bad guys? This is bad guy music. Now oh well. Oh, the bad guys are over there. I actually need to, I need to actually use Black Widow here, because she only she can scan and do athletics. Let's go to Black Widow. There we go. The scaffolding is glitchy. Well, it's not really glitchy, it's just like all those little beams and stuff are also... I guess platforms you can stand on, so they're just standing all over the place. So it's up, up here first. Then like three clustered over here. Oops, there we go. Uh, that's a thing to blow up. We're gonna need Hawkeye for that. I don't think Hawkeye has athletics to get up there though. Can he... Athleticize? Oh, he can! Okay. I forgot he can do that cuz I'm an idiot. But at least it was it was at least it was just like a thing that I didn't remember that actually was told to me and not, you know, the whole bullshit of oh hey, by the way, you can just press triangle to put on an Iron Man suit. <sighs> I got to let that go at some point. I can just fly up here. What am I doing? Okay, so I blew this up. We can make that bridge for the others to cross. Yay! Progress is being made. And not being... Not being uh, sacrificed at the uh, the Avenger Tower party, which was totally a necessary thing to put in the level, by the by. It wasn't. We could have done with that. This is an action game. Keep it to the action scenes. We don't need to see the party. That really wasn't a thing that we really needed to do. What is this doing? Oh! What's all this, then? I was holding on the, 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 the X button, because I, I just saw that it, it was making, a, a, making a, a meter go. That's neat. Oh, hey! Purple stud! I'll take that! <laughs> lucky, lucky me. Okay. So now we got to get the uh, door open. And I, oh, okay, I, I, did, I do see a stealth thing on the other side of that wall. Let's get Black Widow. Turn her into stealth mode. Or the ghost studs can do that for me. The ghost studs can take me to... Well, they're just taking me to the door. Yeah, I already know I have to go through the door. I have to open the door first. And I saw a... Security cam around here that I need to stealth pass. But that will be for the next part. Because I am out of time. So I'm going to cut the video here. And when we come back... Tech time with Black Widow. I've been Rado Goji, and I'll be here next time. Join me, won't you?